two major power surges within two years. That's what the Deerfield community is dealing with right now. We Energies confirms it was caused by an ash tree falling on their power lines, which you can actually see happening here in the video behind us. NBC 15's Marcus Arsvald spoke with two families affected, and Marcus, they are very frustrated with the company. Yeah, Deerfield community members say something needs to change. One family I spoke with might have to replace appliances they just had fixed after this happened in 2022. Washer, dryer, stove, dishwasher, microwave, hot tub, furnace, water heater, garage doors, my work computer, coffee pot, and I'm just probably getting started. Mitch Bone says he's spent a lot of money trying to replace equipment destroyed in two power surges within two years. When I came out of my bedroom here in the middle of the night, basically you're talking Chevy Chase, that Christmas vacation movie, Those all those LED lights were extremely um, bright, way brighter than they ever get. And after the surge and the power finally disconnected from the Christmas tree, the Christmas tree went down all the balls. They were all over. There's still a couple I missed over there. We Energy spokesperson Brendan Conway says this surge happened after a dead ash tree fell on top of their power lines. We certainly understand these things are frustrating. Um, they're incredibly rare. But when they happen to you twice, even more frustrating. Even though the tree fell on top of their power lines, he says it's far enough away that they're not responsible for the surge, something residents like Brian Wilson have heard before. And it just seems like we constantly are complaining to We Energies, and we're like, hey, you know, you guys obviously have service problems or you have mechanical issues with your, your equipment. You know, our frustration is, what are you doing about it? Because it seems like in the last few years you haven't done anything, and it keeps getting worse and worse and worse. What do you say to customers who feel like your company is more worried about protecting yourselves than keeping them safe? We understand any customer's frustration, particularly after going through this, right? Um, that's why what we're telling them, um, is let us show you, you know, the the, uh, the solutions we want to help provide. Bone says the community needs more than solution discussions. He wants to see more action from We Energies as he's worried about appliances starting on fire again. I'm fearful right now that you know tonight when we lay down in our house something might start on fire. I have no idea. You know, imagine laying in your house. You don't know if you're going to have to grab your kids because oh. Well, they missed something, right? Or whatever. Oh, another power surge. Oh, a fire happened because of it. You don't really know. The township of Deerfield is holding a meeting at the community center Monday night at 7. The board asks anyone impacted by the surge to speak about their issues publicly. Live in the newsroom, Marcus Sarsvold, NBC 15 News.